get ready because by the end of this video, your Apple Watch is gonna be more accurate for your next workout. Roll the intro. This is the first video of 2022. So if you're new here, happy new year. My name is Al and this is a place where we go over the best tech for health and fitness. If you're into that kind of thing, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell because I put out videos every week. Starting this new year, instead of Monday, I'll be uploading videos every Friday. I wanted to give it a nice name. So starting now until indefinitely, We'll be calling these Fitness Tech Fridays in five minutes. So let's get started on today's video, how you can make your Apple Watch more accurate. So what you'll need is your Apple Watch and your iPhone. And the first thing we're gonna do is on the iPhone, we're, we're gonna need to enable some of the settings on here to make sure that all the information or the proper information is being tracked accurately for your next workout. Open the settings app, choose privacy, now tap location services, check location services is turned on at the top, swipe down to the very bottom and tap system services, check motion calibration and distance is toggled on. Now the next thing we need to do is make sure that our information on our iPhone is up to date. This right over here. Our weights could have gone up, our weights could have gone down, so we want to make sure this is accurate. In order to get here, we're going to Open up your iPhone and go towards the watch app. On here, choose my watch tab in the bottom left corner. Swipe down, tap health. Make sure your height and your weight and everything else is accurate. Awesome, so you got that step down. Now the last thing we're gonna do on the iPhone is we need to make sure that we reset the calibration data. So while we're in the same app, we're going to choose the my watch tab in the bottom left corner. Swipe down and tap privacy. Tap reset fitness calibration data. You completed everything that you needed to do on the iPhone. So now we're gonna move on to the Apple Watch. Now by any chance, if you're watching this video and you might just have bought an Apple Watch, maybe it was gifted to you, I do wanna let you know, I made a video a few weeks ago on the five best features on the Apple Watch. I'll put it right over here so you can click on it and watch it after this video. But now, for the Apple Watch, I'm gonna read you directly what's on the Apple website. To calibrate the Apple Watch, head outside to a flat open door area that offers good GPS reception. For Apple Watch Series 2 and later, you don't need to bring iPhone. For Series 1 and 0, you do. Open the workout app on your Apple Watch and start an outdoor walk or run. Complete 20 minutes or so of the walk slash run. Now, the Apple website also does share that you don't have to run or walk for 20 minutes at a time. If you wanna break it up, you can do that as well. The most important part is that you do it outside and you're in a good area that has cellular connection on your iPhone or Apple Watch. And the last thing you could do to make sure that your Apple Watch is reading the most accurately possible is wearing it correctly. You don't wanna have this too tight or too loose and you wanna make sure that every once in a while you clean the back of the sensor. There you go guys, in five minutes, how to make your Apple Watch more accurate. Hope this helps. Let me know in the comments if you do this, if you see a significant improvement on your Apple Watch. Again, if you're new here, hit that like button. It really makes this video get seen by more people. It really helps me out. Again, if you like this, consider subscribing and happy new year. I'll see you in the next video. See you next Friday.